When we look at nut carcinoma, it can be helpful to take a step back and look at what we know so far. Nut carcinoma is a rare type of cancer that first came to the attention of doctors through just a couple of patients. It's a type of cancer that starts in the lining of an organ in the body and quickly grows from there. We see that it can affect many different organs and can happen anywhere in the body, often occurring in the chest, head or neck. We know from research that it's caused by a genetic mutation. In fact, that's where it gets its name from. It's caused by a mutation or rearrangement in a gene called nut. And we see from research that anyone can be affected by nut carcinoma, with the most common age of diagnosis between 16 and 23. We also see from research that the symptoms of nut carcinoma are not unique to this type of cancer. And that means it can be difficult for doctors to tell it apart from other types of cancer, like head and neck or lung cancer. However, there is a test for nut carcinoma that makes it possible to diagnose it. Put simply, the test involves taking a sample from the cancer growth, adding a coloured antibody to it, and looking at the sample under a microscope. To understand the appropriate way to treat this rare cancer, Doctors and scientists are carrying out research on different therapies in people with the condition right now. The results of this research may help to make it clearer which therapy options could be appropriate for different patients with nut carcinoma. With every day that passes, our understanding of nut carcinoma is growing, and there is hope that this growing knowledge may help many patients across the world in the future.